the Orlando Magic are giving Franz Wagner a huge contract. A contract, five years, $224 million maximum rookie contract. This means this is the most money he could have got after being a rookie. So obviously, the Orlando Magic lock up their man, Franz Wagner. And I know this is like an overpay, but this is smart for the Magic. Lock him up now and also lock up Bancaro when you can probably next year. Um, Franz, you know, he's not a good three-point shooter, but he can do everything else. Uh, like last year, he shot 28% from three, which is atrocious. But he did shoot 48% from the field, which is really good. 19.7 points. So he can average around 20 to 25 points. I mean, he is still developing. Um, he's getting better every year. And who knows? Maybe his three-point gets better. And the contract is also up to $269 million if he makes an all-star appearance, which he could, but you never know. The East has some really good players. Um, yeah, Franz Wagner, he, he's a really good player, can rebound, can get assists. I know it only says 5.3, but he's not a center. So for a uh, forward, that's pretty good. 3.7 assists, 48% from the field, like I mentioned. That is really, really good. He has a really good inside game, probably one of the best inside games um, in terms of layups, and he can dunk and you know, they re-signed his brother, Mo Wagner, and yeah, so, you know, it's good that they locked him up. Was it overpay? Yes, but that doesn't mean that this is a bad contract. The Magic need to keep Wagner and Bancaro because those two are the main pieces. They need to add one more piece, but unfortunately, it won't be in this free agency as Paul George is gone. DeMar DeRozan has signed that it's going to probably be traded. Uh, to the Kings, that's not official, but looks like that's going to happen. So it just seems like the the Magic will only sign KCP, which I, I don't really like. I wish the Magic did more. I wish we could have got Paul George, who also, you know, signed. Um, Clay Thompson even didn't sign with the Magic, which I am happy about, actually, because I think we'd have to pay him. I mean, the contract he got was decent, but I, I feel like he would want more from the Magic. But because we had more to give uh, than the Mavericks. But even – it just seemed like Lake Thompson wanted to be there because I heard the Lakers offered him more money, and he turned it down. But anyway, this is not about Clay Thompson and the other free agents. This is about Franz Wagner and rewarding him for helping this team be a fifth seed last year, which nobody predicted, not even myself. And I think this year they could be a top four seed if they can stay healthy, and we'll see how KCP contributes. Um Obviously, I wish they did more during this free agency, but locking up Franz right now is a smart move. Hopefully, they uh, lock up Bancaro soon and um, keep this core together and make sure none of them leave like Shaquille or anybody else. Uh, but now, NBA free agents don't really leave their teams as much as they used to. But yeah, um, please tell me in the comments below what you think about this signing. Uh, thanks you for watching. See you around the bend. See you in the next video and peace out.